Good afternoon, graduates, faculty, parents, and distinguished guests. It is a great honor and immense joy to be Cristo Rey Columba's alumni speaker today. While I'm not able to celebrate with you in person, I'm glad to be part of this milestone and share some words of inspiration. Writing this speech truly filled me with an overwhelming sense of nostalgia and excitement because it was not too long ago that I too was ready to embark on my own journey as a recent graduate. Six years ago, I sat where you sit now, brimming with a mix of excitement and nerves, dreaming about what the future would hold and meticulously crafting a 10-year plan, which is unsurprising if you knew me back in high school. I had life all figured out, starting with leaving the familiarity of Columbus behind, graduating college with my family beside me, and eventually landing a job in a bustling international city. Well, let me tell you, it's amusing to look back and realize how much life loves to surprise us, even when we think we have it all mapped out. But let me get back to this in a bit. Now let's rewind the clock further a whole decade ago when I was part of the inaugural class at Crystal Ray. What a ride it was. It truly transformed me, molding my character, honing my skills, and setting me on the path to becoming who I am today. I still carry all of those lessons in my back pocket. For Mr. Corrigan, that it's always a perfect time for a keyboard music break. From Miss Martin, that poetry will feed your soul. And from gym class, that I am in fact not made to play basketball. <laughs> but without a doubt, the memories and lessons I learned within Crystal Ray's walls have remained a constant source of strength for me, as I hope they will be for you. One of the greatest things I learned from Crystal Ray is that what affects one part of the body affects the whole. We went through a lot together, from moving into a new school building to teacher turnover, taking part in intimate retreats and establishing traditions. Our teachers created classroom space for us to have difficult conversations when we needed to, let us know it was okay to be vulnerable and showed us the power and importance of community. Let me give you an example. The 2016 election happened during my senior year. There was nervousness among our class because the topic of immigration was hotly debated leading up to it. I am proudly the daughter of Mexican immigrants. So on election day, there was a somberness that eventually developed into true fear of what would happen to our parents, of what would happen to us. Our teachers paused their curriculum and their concern turned to our well-being. And in that day of uncertainty, we knew we were in a safe place. I held on to this lesson closely when I stepped foot on a predominantly white and wealthy Ivy League campus. There is little else that could have prepared me for Brown than the unity of our Cristo Rey class. Little else that could have prepared me to explain poverty to multiple classmates during discussion sections or fight the university for ethical investments in our food systems and away from war weapons. It took me one full year to move beyond imposter syndrome and feel comfortable taking up space on campus. In that year, the thing that changed was finding strong friendships and community through activism organizations, the Brown Catholic community, and the undocumented low-income student center. Friends in these groups created space for me as a marginalized student and reminded me that my life experiences were stories worth telling, especially on a campus where students like me hadn't existed for centuries. Graduates, as you prepare to step out into the world, remember that you are a change agent and your existence in these systems and institutions is revolutionary. You have overcome countless challenges, both academically and personally, to reach this pivotal moment. You did it together, made it through challenges that you couldn't imagine, from the chaotic shift to virtual classes, to unexpected distance from friends, from sleepless nights studying for exams, to pandemic haircuts. You have proven time and time again that you possess the tenacity to adapt and overcome any obstacle that comes your way. In this rapidly changing world where new technologies like AI emerge and global challenges loom, it's easy to feel daunted. But let me assure you that you are equipped with the tools to thrive and make a lasting impact. You have a strong foundation to build a future that is uniquely yours. Remember that success is not measured solely by material achievements, but by the positive impact that you have on the world around you. I know that each of you will accomplish extraordinary feats, but never forget to stay true to yourselves and to the people that have guided you thus far. 
Let your action be driven by compassion and a genuine desire to make a difference. I guarantee you that you will never regret time spent in service of others because you are your community. When you pour into others, you pour into yourself. Now, when I started this speech, I mentioned my so-called 10-year plan that included moving to a big city and how my life journey has transformed since then. Well, the reason for this transformation is rooted in the profound realization that changing the world starts and ends with the meaningful connections we foster at the local level. It has been the honor of my career to work alongside our neighbors at the Reeb Center to build a thriving Southside community. Use the values instilled in you by Krista Ray to be empathetic and socially responsible individuals. Never underestimate the power of a helping hand or an act of goodwill. It is through these meaningful gestures that you can truly change the world. I stand here as living proof that the foundation laid within these walls has the power to propel you to extraordinary heights. Trust in your abilities, embrace your passions, and never lose sight of the unique gifts you possess. As you embark on this incredible journey, carry with you the memories, friendships, and remember, it is always a perfect time for a music break. Congratulations, class of 2023. May your futures be as bright as the light you bring into the world. Thank you.